What's going on everybody? It's Mr. Arrow HD here, and we are here with a new relatively well, new series called Dat Lean. Um, I don't know if that's gonna the way it's the name is gonna stay or what I'm gonna do with it, but here am I am attempting, making an effort, because I like doing this and you guys like watching it. Um, this is the car that I promised in the <laughs> This is the car I promised in the um, the last video that I did with Dat Lean, which uh, wasn't officially part of the series. Is the personal projects video. This is my original first ever Datley mobile. This is a Chevy Impala, and it's it's got some swag. Um, this car is of course purple. It's got almost a thousand horsepower. Uh, everything's maxed to the teats. I think it's got race everything except for tires. Got big dubs on it because why not? Uh, pedal bear on the side. Preparation H logo, the big fuck your shit on the front that I don't think you can see in this. Um, and the logo on the back says Tony Danza's Tap Dancing Extravaganza. It was based off a real band, but um, I thought it was funny, so I named our that lean team of Chevy and Paul as we entered a team tandem competition with this car. Uh, all of us were using it, me and three friends, and uh, we just basically ran into each other, but uh, we were the only group that did not spit out, so we won. Cool. Um... I don't really, yeah, see, this is why I don't know about doing commentaries, because I don't know what you guys want me to say here. It's bouncy, it holds lots of angle, uh, but you have to be careful with it, because you can't just toss the weight around like you can with other cars. But, um, you guys wanted to see a Dat Lean series, so here you go. I don't really know how permanent this is going to be, but, uh, you know, as you see the car twisting, tweaking around right there, this is definitely a lot bouncier than the uh, Eldorado was. Uh, it's, you know, like I said, it's raised up all the way. I mean, all your suspension components are as soft as they can go. Uh, negative 5 front and rear camber. That's how all these cars will be set up. Um, this is a bounce, <laughs> Um, basically, this is just, I make these cars for fun. Um, they're not the best drift cars in the world, and I go over my 700-ish horsepower cap that I give myself, but who cares, right? <laughs> it's, it's all about fun. That's why we... That's why we drift. Um, so when I'm making cars like these that are a little bit silly, I kind of just go all out. Yeah, I love this guy. He swerves off the track, then back on the track, and then I try passing him, and he cuts me off repeatedly. Like, what? What? I don't understand. And then I have to do this. I have to cut through the grass to pass him. Like, if you see somebody behind you tailing you in an online lobby, get out of the way. And if they choose to stay back there, then they choose to stay back there. Um... But yeah, uh, I don't know. I like this car. It's fun. Uh, it's, it's one of my, hey, I kind of feel like doing something fun. So I'm going to pull this out. It's usually what I do. Um, but really, this series is for you guys. Um, this is kind of reason. It's a way to like for me to do all those cars that I always wanted to do but can't, um, can't really do due to some, certain things. Like, you know, oh, I don't want to run this much horsepower. Oh, I don't want to run this or whatever. But, um, everything that's extremely goofy you may see pop up here um, instead of a builder to kill it or whatever. But uh, yeah, this if you want to get into Datlin cars, this is definitely one of them, one of the ones that I suggest because uh, it is good and it is also hilarious. That is a win-win situation. So yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching. This is my first Saturday video. I never uploaded the video on Saturday before. I'm trying to do seven videos a week. Uh, is that going to go well? Maybe, maybe not. But um, the situation here is if you guys have any suggestions for this series, uh, let me know. I tried to change it up a little bit um, by doing the replay cam. But if you guys have any ideas, I'm really open to them. Not in terms of what car to do, but what to do with the series. So thank you. Leave a comment below, and I'll see you tomorrow.